Hello, this is Cookie from Cookie.in and you're watching the handset and gaming review of Micromax Canvas Turbo Mini, also called the Micromax A200. It is a trimmed down version of Micromax Turbo. This dual sim handset is powered by 1.3 GHz quad core processor. It's extremely lightweight. Screen resolution is 720p, runs on the Android 4.2 with 1GB RAM, 4GB internal storage. There is 8MP rear focus camera, 5MP front camera. The battery is 1800mAh capacity. Inside the box, you will find the handset. The travel charger, data cable, earphone, the one that you usually get with the Micromax handsets, SIM ejector pin, download goodies from Micromax, warranty card, SAR compliance and the user manual. The A200 has got a premium look, it is pretty slim and is extremely lightweight. It looks like that the body is made up of aluminium though it's not specifically mentioned on the Micromax website. The build quality and the finishing is very good. The sound value mentioned on the back side. Here are the three touch sensitive buttons. You can see the mic here. On the top there is the in-call speaker, the sensors and the front camera. Volume rockers and the power button are placed on the right side. On the top you will find the 3.5mm audio jack and the micro USB port. On the left side there is the micro sim tray. You need to use the pin to eject the tray. You need a micro sim card. And this is sim slot 2. The back side has got a metallic finish. Here is the speaker out. The Micromax logo. LED flash. And the 8 megapixel rear out focus camera. You can open up this part here. And inside you'll find the SIM slot one. This is a normal SIM and uh, this is the micro SD card slot. As mentioned before, the key highlight about this handset is the super lightweight. The weight with battery is 110 grams. Thickness is 8.38 mm. The breadth is 68.39 mm and the length is 137.27 mm. I have switched on the handset and here is the home screen. The touch is smooth and responsive but make sure to clean off the screen after removing the factory fitted film. Here is the BBM app and the Kingsoft Office. Here are the different options. The viewing angle is good. The interface is a bit customized. Here are the smart cashier options. We have a hotspot, USB and Bluetooth tethering is supported. 0.98 GB is allocated for apps and uh, 1.61 GB as the internal storage. Here is the storage for apps and of the 1 GB RAM you get around 687 MB free. I have connected an external pen drive using the OTG cable and as you can see OTG is supported. Here are the GPS option, Hindi language is also supported and here is the notification LED. The middle part is aluminium and this one is plastic. Micromax website has not specifically mentioned that the body is made up of aluminium. The middle part does look like aluminium and the top and the bottom part is uh, plastic. If you look closely inside especially at this part it does look like aluminium. System information Cortex A7 1.3 GHz. We already seen this hardware on many other handsets. It's uh, with the Mali 400 MP GPU. The hardware is MediaTek MT6582 running on the Android 4.2.2 with screen resolution of 1280 by 720 pixels. Here are the list of sensors accelerometer, proximity light, magnetic, and orientation. The time is 11:46, battery at 49%, and the temperature at 31 degrees. Quadrant benchmark score is 5859. Android score is 17177, Vilamo HTML5 1922, Metal 501, Nina Mark 2 53.6 FPS and this handset supports 10 point multi-touch. And now let's check out the camera. The camera comes with two unique features, GIF animation and remove object. The rear camera is 8 megapixel as you can see, front camera is 5 megapixel and this is the video mode, it can record full HD videos. I'm going to try the remove object. When you choose this option, the handset will shoot series of images. 
you then get an option to remove the objects that you don't want. On the box pack, it's mentioned that the handset can record 720p videos. I'm now going to record a video. I've started the video recording. And uh, this video was recorded in 1080p resolution at 30 frames per second. It can record Full HD videos. You can record as well as play Full HD videos. Now let's check out the gaming part. This is the Modern Combat 4. This game got installed on the external storage. Yes, you can save apps on the external storage. The gameplay is very smooth but at times it does lag. Watch carefully now, it will lag a bit. But overall the game is playable. And now let's check out the Asphalt 8. It is by default set to the medium visual quality. I'm going to change it to high. This is not bad. It is smooth but it's not very good. I'm going to change back to medium visual quality. It's much better now. After using this handset for around 49 minutes, the battery dropped by 23% and the temperature is 39 degrees. The Micromax Canvas Turbo Mini is a very good handset in the MediaTek 1.3GHz quad-core category. It comes with a 4.6 inch screen, 1GB RAM, 4GB internal storage. This handset can record Full HD videos, OTG is supported and you can also save apps on the external storage. The handset is lightweight at 110 grams and it is light on the pockets too. It is available for a price of approximately 10,700. For full review, sample images and videos, visit my website, govi.in.